to go now. Why does that sound like you're not coming with us? These are my people. Some still survive if I stay. Then we'll stay and help. Go. I'll be where I'm needed when I need to be. Just trust me. Don't go dying on me. I'm starting to actually get you. Papa Squat Golden Boy, you're making me nervous. Or perhaps your nerves need gnawing. What did I do? This precarious plan proves more meek by the moment. The Madonna was meant to be among us. She knows what she's doing. Eventually. What sorry sins I have wrought to rest me among such a motley crew. Did he? Did he take my room? Not so much as a yip from the mud. Groot says he'll keep trying. Where's Mr. Fancy Words? He has assumed Peter Quill's quarters. It was a daring display of dominance. Don't you start. Usually I'd say who needs him, but we do. So you better fix this one, Quill. Just try not to piss him off any more than he already is. If it is to be a fight to the death, I will honor the outcome. If he kills you, I get your guns. bet on Peter winning that fight. It took all five of us to beat him last time. I still can't believe he caught one of my smart bombs. Just like that. We have already fought the man. Oh, hey, Quill. You seem like you're in a good mood. Oh, do I? I've got a great idea for a new blaster extension. Can't wait to put it together. Well, now that the gang's back together and we've got a minute to breathe, I think you deserve an official thank you for what you did on Lamentis. <laughs> Quill, I, uh... I know you don't like that kind of sappy stuff, but I really mean it. Knowing about the crap those scientists did to you, not only does it make my blood boil, it puts everything into perspective. Uh, come on, it was just a puddle. I don't know if I could have gotten over something like that. You saved our lives, man. You deserve a bit of praise. The rodents saved your lives, and scientists were involved. I have many questions. Yeah, well, save them for the next time. We all get a drink together, buddy. Let's make this quick. What do you want, Quill? One tick, done. Doing, doing, done. Ain't gonna get craftsmanship like that anywhere else. I don't think that's where Golden Boy went to. He's in your cabin if you're looking for him, Peter. Hey, Warlock. Open up. This is my room, you know. And that would be my cassette cover. You pen this pithy poetry? It's not poetry, it's music. Hard rock. It's supposed to have guitars and bass and drums. Simplistic scriptures, as is its scribe. Okay, what's your deal, man? What did I do to piss you off? Your lamentable leadership allowed the Madonna to leave when we needed her talents to travel to the telepathic realm. Mantis had good reason to stay behind. 
We just need to get Nikki and get the hell out so we can find her again. Your tenuous tactics trust too much to fortune. Can you confidently convince me your meager measures may amply manage this mission? Yes. Absolutely. Wise words. Sure and measured. But beheld by my bemused misgivings, your demeanor differs distinctly in direction from my more willful ways. Maybe we can meet in the middle, then. Yes. An oath! Will you own an oath to operate with greater aggression? To give gravitas to gravid seasons of your soul and struggle not to stand on destiny's icy flows? Sure, man. Whatever it takes. Then assert it. I swear I'll be a good leader. That'll be decisive and... and uh, that I won't let Manus do whatever she wants. I stand partially reassured. What about you, Mr. Fancy Words? How do I know you won't see Raker and have a change of heart? Why would I weasel away? Didn't you used to be best buds with him? We were common company for a fleeting fallow, through which I witnessed the incommensurable extent of his sadness. He mourns his lost son. That's why he's doing all of this. The church, the matriarch? Because he wants to get his kid back. But that can't happen, right? Megas can't... No. Cannot. So? We can count on you? When you reunite with Raker, that man's gotta go down. Indubitably. So, how is he? Frustrating. It's like talking to Suzanne Harris at the summer dance all over again. Ain't that the Humi girl you tried to impress with your yo-yo skills? Yeah, and it went about as well as talking to Mr. Cape. What's a yo-yo? explains why we ain't been able to reach Cosmo. If you don't answer it, they'll vaporize us. I will handle this communication. All yours, buddy. Hey, old traveler. Have you accepted the truth of the divine promise? We have. My deceased wife and daughter are with me. Thank the matriarch for the gift. May the promise be fulfilled. You are clear to land at the spaceport. Regiments, while we wait, whistling in the wings. Landing as fast as I can, go. What the flark? Great, the coon boy thinks he's a butterfly now. He is a man of action. Let's just hope that he can keep the church busy while we look for Nikki. Didn't think you'd be able to bluff your way through security muscles. I am quite adept at deception. We're gonna need more than that to get to the Continuum Cortex and rescue Nikki. Especially with Golden Boy jumping ship. Should we, like, try to find him? Time is running out. We cannot lose focus if we are to save the girl. Drax is right. Let's just hope Warlock can do a bit of damage on... his side. Let's do this. Time to save Nikki. 
leader. Okay. Must be cool. Let me handle these guys. Travelers, have you come to witness the fulfillment? The what now? The realization of the Matriarch's promise. The beginning of a new world. One without death, or pain, or fear. You should know this. Weren't you vetted and cleared to land here? What? Of course we were. How are you not aware of the fulfillment? Something is wrong. These heretics must be stopped! Attack! Trouble? From these guys? Well, I say trouble is our middle name. Who said we were in trouble? When we're slicing scuts with a knife or a blade? When we're shooting fast and Groot's making shade? That's what I call trouble. Who's with me? That wasn't that was the house. Unique. Stop the short, Groot! Back, cross it! Is weakened. Attack! Let's make him feel it. Wacko's better prey than your world comes without death or pain or fear. Cause I'm gonna kill him for parking up this spaceport. They have been very busy redecorating. All the more reason for us to get to the cortex and find Nikki. Nikki. Yeah, Quill's just doing some uh, preparation work. God! Cosmos Tower's shut down. Are you good? That's because it's never been dark before. You do realize some of the guys shooting at us were nowhere security? This does not go well for the dog. Never was the Mutt's biggest fan, but we could have used the backup telepath. Just because the tower shut down doesn't mean Cosmo is too. Last time we were here, he knocked out me, Gamora, and Drax, and Lady Hellbender's bounty hunters, like it was nothing. We just gotta have faith he's okay. Really, Peter? Faith? There does appear to be an excess of the story. If the promise is to be realized here, Converted will be flocking into witnesses. Are we the only new arrivals? We must be late, as usual. Marketplace. The same thing we saw when we flew in. Yeah, but it'll be up close. Nowhere really stunk sometimes, but. Clark! Over there! There's so many of them. I thought most nobodies would have rejected the promise. Everyone wants something they can't have. Yeah, but these crooks were suspicious of anyone. You're right, Rocket. The people who lived here were rough. I once saw someone beat someone else to a pulp because they gave them a compliment. No way they'd willingly join up. A sword to the throat can be very convincing. So can the promise. 
They got Flark and Faith batteries everywhere. Just like on Hal's Hope. Perhaps they have built another giant ray gun inside the Continuum Cortex. To siphon Faith from multiple worlds at once? Is that even possible? The energy ain't filling these batteries. It's moving away from them. So they're powering something. Sure looks like it. Hey, check it out. We got bad guys. Get ready to die. They do not fear death. go. Hundred units says they're tied to the fulfillment. The priest said that they were bringing... They can't raise the dead, especially after we saved Nikki. Half as secure as the dog thought. The church's forces increased by the tick. Their superior numbers could have easily breached the defenses. While well, we got just the five of us. Filling us all with confidence there, big guy. Over here! Looks like we can squeeze through. We must be close to Mantlo's bar. Can you see it? Not really. There's a lot of debris in the way. There is no way through this wall. Could be a bunch of wackos just waiting for us on the other side. Good point. Peter, you... Hey! Peter! Well, that didn't work. I'm going in. What about the fanatics? Gamora, you should be able to get your sword in there now. Give me a boost. Let's hope it holds. Oh, God! Not Mantlos. Look at her. This is personal, Quill. Peter, Wonder if go. any of these fortune tellers saw this coming. Unlikely. They were all shotguns. Most of them were pickpockets and fences. Pretty useful people to know. I know how much you love this dive. It was the one spot in this whole Flarkin galaxy where a guy could feel safe. I mean, except for the bar brawls and the security raids and the bounty hunters. We'll drink to it later. Right now, we've got to keep moving. There has been no sign of Goldie Braun since he left from our ship. Adam Warlock. Might be splatted somewhere across the lower city. Or got picked up by a wandering creep squad. Or maybe he was lying about which side he was on and is just waiting to attack us. Yeah, what do we need the Golden Boy for anyways? We were doing fine without him. I was not fine. Magus was devouring my soul. Your memory is suspect. You know why we need Warlock to stop Magus' space magic ritual? We don't know space magic. Yeah, because that ain't a real thing. Man, I'm not so sure anymore. Not after. Careful, Peter Quill. Guys, look down. It's an awful lot of light. You're thinking it's the full Flarkman, ain't you? But it could just be runoff from the cables. Whatever these whack jobs are up to, they need a lot of juice. Perhaps this is how they powered their fleet to reach Lamentus. Nah, the Cortex could... Maybe Raker's trying to reanimate the Celestial Head, bring it back to life? Perhaps he wishes to turn it into a ship. Bah, this thing's deader than dead. It ain't coming back and it ain't jumping through no hyperspace. They say Celestials are powered by hyperspace. Regardless, we must reach the Undercity to find the girl and stop whatever they are doing. And we'll have to be ready for them to try and stop us. The converted ones will be prepared to die in order to bring their loved ones back to life. Which is pretty ironic if you think about it. That's not the way to Cosmos. There might be something down there we can use. Through. Ah, the 
The seedy underbelly, seedy underbelly. You know, they used to run a poacher's ring out of here. Is that what that smell was? Yep, rotting beasts from Mac Loophole. Just really hoping there'd be hover bikes down here. Why would there be? No outrageous parking fees, for one. And two, sometimes you want to drop something off without anyone else seeing. Can you squeeze in there? Yep, let's see where it goes. So if there were hover bikes down here, we could have hopped on and zipped down to the lower city. Me and Groot used to do it all the time. There you go. Should be safe. Should be. You ain't getting electrocuted, but there could be a hole in the floor, for all I know. Dead end. And let's continue before Nikki becomes a dead end, too. Our level of cooperation is invigorating. We have become a formidable team. Yep, sure have, Drax. Ain't we just one big, happy flark and family? She's not garbage. Behold the power of the light! Via Magnati! Never better. Yep, definitely not good. Gamora, wait, hold on a sec. Why? It's 
two more children can be sacrificed in the name of Rager's flarked up church? Of course not, just... Just what, Peter? I don't know. Breathe. Every minute we waste. We don't have time to breathe. I know Raker brings back bad memories. This isn't about Thanos. It's about Nikki and what men like Raker and Thanos do to girls like her. Like me. My sister. If I had just been better at protecting Nebula, maybe... Maybe she wouldn't be dead. Whoa. What? Nebula's dead? How? By who? Tell me, so I can find him and shake his attacking hand. By me. You killed your sister? She is the one you saw in the Matriarch's Promise. That's how I knew it was a lie. The Nebula I knew had been twisted into a hateful, vengeful monster thing. One who would never stop unless I stopped her. So I did. I just never expected to survive. Why didn't you say something? It's not exactly a conversation starter. Hi, I'm Gamora. I murdered my sister. Can we be friends? Of course we can't. How can you be friends with a monster? Why would you want that on your team? A team I actually... kind of enjoyed being on. All things considered. Well, uh, I hate Nebula, so I actually would have... What? I'm just saying it don't change nothing. Actually, it changes everything. The most deadly woman in the galaxy just admitted... she loves us. I did not. You did? You said you were in love with us right after the part about killing your sister. I said I enjoyed your company. That is the Katathian definition of love. Like. I I'll give you like. C can we just move on? Agreed. That's about all the love fest I could take. We accept you, Gamora Zenugri. Pretty sure we're married now. This is excruciating. All right, I'm pretty sure we've all caught our breath. Let's say we go stop a nut job cult leader. Yes. Let's get to the bridge. Cosmos Tower is the quickest way. Too wide to cross. Maybe we can bridge the gap. We keep saying bridge, and it's starting to sound like a made-up word. All words are made up. That seems long enough for a bridge. Unless it crumbles when it falls. Drax? I have been eager to topple something over. You know... I usually hate it when that Cosmo spotlight would shine down on me. Really? A faith force field? If we can find the power source, we should be able to turn it off. Let's get looking then. Thank you. 
kid in the ritual thing? You gotta disconnect the power, Quilt. So, Gamora... How am I supposed to drop... That's it, Peter. Let's go. We need to get out of here before Raker shows up. All right, get ahead! Let's book it! Now is not the time for literature! <laughs> Guardians of the galaxy. The matriarch has chosen to enact the fulfillment from this station. And you shall not stop her. She hasn't chosen anything. You've been manipulating her from the start. She is the light. And I am merely her servant. Kind of hard to be the light with that dark monster thingy inside of her. Blasphemy! You may have rejected her. But you will believe when it returns you from death's cold clutches. Your pain has pushed you to a perilous precipice, old friend. You die. The form is fleeting, but the foundation remains forever. Now cease this stubborn senselessness before it reaps a ruinous reward. Ruinous. We don't need 
need Golden Boy's help? Is that why you shot him? <laughs> oh yeah, that was great. Right in the butt. Did you see the look on his face? It was all like, oh, my gilded glutes. Regal rear. His perfect posterior. His champion cheeks. Finally, I think they're giving up. Just in time, because we're not getting back on that bridge. I know where we are. There's a road nearby that intersects the main bridge to Cosmos. Where? It should be, uh, right below us. Drax, buddy, let's make a hole. One does not make a hole, Peter Quill. It is the absence of something. That's one way down. The best way. <sighs> We need to be on the other side of this thing. We're not getting over no. Under suffice. Look! They're still at it! At least our guy seems to be winning. I did see a floor directly below this one. I ain't seeing no hatch or nothing. Hey, Quill, try your visor. Anyone see a way across? Yeah, we can't do nothing with that sign in the way, Quill. This carnage brings back troubling memories of worlds I destroyed. Always wondered, what did you use to do that? Ba -ba -ba boom, baby! You sure are destroying a lot of advertising today. Like we need another reminder to buy Calex cream. Part of the floor looks weak. Good thing we got old big boots. It is not the size of the boot, but the might of the one who wields it. Is he gonna make us a bridge or what? <laughs> who cares if he didn't ask? This ain't no time to be polite, you big stump. Don't suppose Groot knows another side route. If I could just get to the other side, I could hack that thing and drop the bridge. If you can get to the other side, we can get to the other side, and it wouldn't matter. <sighs> Throw me. What? Throw me! Just get muscles to huck me across. Are you kidding? After the fit you threw last time? This ain't like the last time. You all... I trust you guys. Leave this to me! Whoa! <laughs> Valued member of this team, not a tool to be thrown about. Worried about this ritual, and what's really gonna happen if we can't stop it? Ain't gonna be dead people coming back, holding hands and wagging tails, that's for sure. We won't have to worry about that. I know I can get through to Nikki. This is Raker's doing, not hers. I won't give up on her either. Nor will I. Yeah, and neither will the Grand Unicorn. You will regret it. Perhaps we should summon the ship to deliver us to our destination. Ain't no way they'd let us land anywhere near the big party. Better off fighting our way there. Oh, 
dumb are these flartnards to even fall for this full flarkment garbage? Magus demands adulation, trapping you with vile illusion while feeding on your soul. I felt it in my promise, too. That endless hunger. Oh, yeah. Hungry is an understatement. Holy faith! All that light isn't leading to the cortex. It is the cortex. How could that mutt let this happen? Looks like you'll get to ask him yourself. This isn't going to end well. Cosmo! We've got to get down there! Don't count him out just yet. I've seen him get out of worse scrapes. Beast is being exposed to the promise! No! Get away from my dog! I have slain the believer! Don't be sad! Keep hiking, they're shutting lights out! off the battlefield, Peter Quill. Our enemies are melting before us. <laughs> like butter on a hot knife. <laughs> Somebody bring me some bread. I have fought many battles, my friends, but none so magnificent as this. <laughs> it is magnificent, Drax. Unbelievably, insanely magnificent. <laughs> right? Like a fork and supernova. So stay on track, keep your eyes open, and shoot for the stars. Who's with me? Today, I Let's am the destroyer! Do this. Feel him? Keep them busy, crew! What's next, Peter? Bust out the smart bump! We gotta keep them off, Cosmo! Let's worry about keeping them off of us first! Stick it to them, crew! Make them hurt the morons! Why does the dog not mind blast them? Just buy him some time to recover! He's a breathing room, Groot! Toss him around! Now, Gamora! I see it! Ah! The mechanical beast is running out of limbs! Oh, you tracks! Light him up, Rocket! Drop him, Jamal! Nobody kicks the dog on my horse! Especially not that one! What the fuck are you doing? He's one of them now. He's our friend. Yeah, so is Drax. And I ain't going inside this Fleabag's head. Maybe it doesn't have to come to that. Hey, buddy. Are you, uh... Take him out before it's too late. Wait! He's still in there. I can hear him. I hear only barking. Focus your mind. He's there. Uh... Oh, fuck it. Just shoot the mutt! No! <sighs> Easy, bud. Friends, remember? He's Peter Quinn. Cosmo knows never lie. lie. Yeah, buddy. It's me. It's all of us. Where is Cosmo smell? The smell of nowhere. Where else would we be? Fur brain. His mind is addled. Or he is simply a dog. He doesn't see us. He's still in the promise. Cosmo, where are you? What do you see? Blue sky. In cars to chase. Cosmo is big. Doma. How you see? Home. 
He's talking about Earth. Smell of fresh grass. Feeling of dirt between paws. No psychic burden, just walkies for going. And the ball for fetching. If you missed your home planet, could you not simply return at any time? Not at time that matter. Same reason Katarthia, not go home. Nowhere is your home. Right here and now. Nowhere is nothing. Dead heads, mind for scrap. It's way more than that. This place is special. If by met you mean I saved your bark, then... Yeah, we met here. It's true. Nowhere was first place since Earth. Cosmo not feel like stray dog. First time, Cosmo forget what was lost. This place is a haven for misfits like us. Like you. It's home. Earth is just some rock where you were born. It's not about rock. It's about what Cosmo had on rock. Foot of bed for sleeping, belly for rubbing, collar with name. You miss being someone's property? Cosmo not property. Belong to family. Then one day, family gone. Men in suits sent Cosmo into space. Cosmo searched many dog years for those he lost. But yet, you had owners. It sounds like they gave you a... What about your puppies, Cosmo? They're your family. Cosmo Young, I... They're here, man. And they're counting on you. For love. For protection. But humans call for Cosmo to heal. Must be loyal. Those pups actually need you. Be loyal to them. Don't abandon them in space the way you were. Cosmo would never. But you have. They're somewhere here on nowhere, maybe needing your help right now. Come on, Cosmo, you gotta know this doesn't smell right. Piotr Quill is right. Cosmo human have no smell. They are wicked perversions. You must bite them with all your might. Be gone! Cosmo not fetch your eyes. That's it, buddy. You tell them! Nowhere is Cosmo home be. His pups, his family. We'll protect it all cost! Sick him, boy! <sighs> Should we help him? I mean, we may need him. I am optimistic for the beast's recovery. Cosmo's got his mission. We've got ours. Let's get to the Cortex. You think he'll be okay? He's got a thick coat. All right, I still got access codes from when me and Groot were on vacation. You mean when you quit the team? Why do you always gotta be so... Flark! Perhaps you entered the code incorrectly. I have made the same mistake. With those sausage fingers? Of course you have. These nimble digits don't make mistakes. I fear I will regret this. So, stolen codes, jail time... What exactly were you and Groot doing down here before? We got a gig from an old contact at Mantlos, before you barged in for a family reunion with Mr. No Lips. Not the weirdest guy I know. You're the weirdest guy I know. The flark was that? An earthquake? Unlikely. We are not on Earth. Whatever they're doing, I think they just took it to the next level. The ritual must be starting soon. Good question, bud. How do we know we could even stop something this powerful? <sighs> eh, probably a question for the bug lady. Too bad she ditched us. When he was in his promise, Drax said Magus was... Eating my soul. And anything that eats can die, right? That don't sound too scientific. You wish to poison its food supply. Eh, we're the food supply, so... No. We'll kill it the old-fashioned way. Yuck. I am so done with brains in the Universal Church of Crap. Drax, 
Jax, how do you keep from breaking your hands, smashing through everything? Guardian of Galaxy, Cosmo is owing Bolshoi here. Help him back! Hey, you got an army of church goods between us and the Cortex. You coming? No. Cosmo is retaking Tower of Security, where his pups are hiding. Without Tower, nowhere is being lost. Pups too. Gotcha. Be careful up there, buddy. security detail. Oh. That's a lot of brain powder. Yeah, that stuff will turn your airway to sludge. Gray lung, they call it. Good thing I've got my mask. Oh, that won't help. Them particles are so hard. Right in. You probably already got the gray lung. Lungs are already gray. And you know that... Drax, little help, Peepo! Readily! Set her down, bud! What are you doing? That's the way we came! I'll be quick! Uh, hurts to see all my investments go up in smoke. What investments? A couple seed fundings into illegal weapons research, funneled some units into goon training, a couple of vets. You had units this whole time? No, they were invested. Drax, over here, hurry! I move as swiftly as is necessary. Well, you know I was just messing with you. What's that? There ain't no such thing as gray lung. <sighs> oh, yeah. I know. <laughs> oh, you so fell for it. Gray lung. Did you guys know? Ah. Careful, this place is practically falling apart. The all of nowhere looks like this soon. It'll get back on its feet. Giant head does not have feet. It used to. Huh. Any ideas, Gamora? I can probably get you up there. I'm surprised Thanos never tried to take Noah's resources during the war. Don't ever underestimate the Collector's political power. He's got something to bribe everyone. The Church accepts no bribes. He seeks only security. Somebody's crotch ain't as effective. Okay, let's make some flark and cool stuff.
On it, and finished. One fine pen. So, about my raise? So they... Just up and left all this once they discover... Hey, Gru, think you can get me up there? Right about there. This seems impertinent to our castle. I want to get a look from up high. Scoping? Scoping? This place smells weird. It's the brains. Go to the tower if it sits too long. It smells like metal and... I don't know, something else. Greer. What's that? It's the waste product of a large contaminated slug. I'm not sure slug piss is exactly what I was thinking of. It is unmistakable. Tremors have intensified. That's one way of putting it. It is an accurate statement. Oh, what have they done to you? Perhaps there is a way to steer nowhere directly into the rift. Can't risk it if Nikki's here. My baby. You, uh, okay, Rocket? No, I ain't okay. The Cortex, nowhere. What's gonna happen to this place? This filthy dump of cheap booze and shady units is the closest thing I got to a home. Come on. This place isn't the only dive bar in the galaxy. We'll find another. You don't get it, Quill. Me and Groot met here. My first arrest was here. There ain't no replacing nowhere. <laughs> Minor hiccup we need to consider. How do we even shut down the cortex now that it's all supercharged? Yeah, there ain't gonna be an easy off button on that thing. Any chance you can hack it? Uh, we ain't talking about some junky appliance. We'll blow it up if that's what it takes. We're dealing with power we've never seen before. No way we'd survive that. I will do it. While the rest of you flee, it'll be an honor. You don't know nothing about explosives. And this is Flarkin' nowhere, man. I ain't blowing up nowhere. Or any of us. We should focus on them faith conduits. I'm betting they all route through the same junction. That's gonna be the weakness. Makes it to the finish line. <laughs> no, Goldie ain't counting on us. To him, we're just a bunch of scut soiling his fancy boots. He's seen what we can do. More importantly, we know what we can do. All right, easy now. So once we get Nikki, we wait for Warlock to catch up and the Bug Lady. Our plan requires a great many people. Let's just take it one thing at a time. Get Nikki and stop this fulfillment thing. How pragmatic of you. Careful. It gets a little... Whoa, 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 whoa. Peter, do you want to do the honors? Totally. Watch this. Surprise, Scott Fuckers! Carve him a new one! Rock it! Blast him! Once we get inside, I'm on Ranger! Let's see! Haven't had a brawl like this since the war! Let us show them how wars are fought! <laughs> <laughs> 
The true battle begins. Everyone ready? Game face is on. I have only one face. Well, put it in mean mode. Huh, done. What's everybody thinking? I'm thinking if Goldie didn't finish him off already, I got a grenade with Raker's name on it. Keep an eye out for Nikki. We get her away from these wackos, then worry about finding Warlock, Mantis, and whoever else. I have faith your spawn will be saved, Peter Quill. Let's not. Everyone quiet. What did they do to the Cortex? Nikki! They strapped her to their Flarkin machine, and they're making the hand direct all the galaxy's faith energy right into it. Fulfillment has begun. We gotta get her out of there, but how? Free the hand, and they lose power. I count four cables. Let's pull them out. My blade should be able to slice into them! Does not seem in pain from this distance anyway. To disrupt their ritual, they will do anything to stop us. Any ritual that involves sacrificing a kid deserves to be stopped. We need to get Nikki out of there before it kills her. Right into that one! Send the Ascorbid in coming! Merge the 
smile at the back of Spartan. I am trying! Guys, huddle up! Victory will soon be ours, my friends. Unless they send reinforcements. If they do, we'll have to move like lightning. Hit them from behind. But what if they're too fast? We'll need another plan. Hey, hey, hey! Every battle comes with some kind of curveball. Trying to predict where it's gonna land only makes things worse. Relax. It's easy to overthink when things get tense, but if we focus... We can hit him hard. Who's with me? Wise words, Peter! Bring it on! Shut down this thing! We save the universe, right? After we get the soul sucking Magus thing out of your kit, yeah! Broke another cultist! These deluded souls do not know when to quit! Okay, I got you. Why do you insist on ruining everything? If you won't join me, then just stay away. This is why I don't have kids. Nikki, this isn't gonna end how you think. Says who? You? I saw what you did. You should want to take it back. I can feel the light inside me. The promise will be fulfilled. Does she not realize her plan has been thwarted? <laughs> A minor setback. Isn't that right, Grand Unifier? Cortex was meant merely to ease the burden on you, Matriarch. We shall retreat. Please, give me an excuse to kill him.
Is this him? The first divine vessel? A pale shadow to your magnificence, matriarch. Let him watch me do what he could not. I'll draw faith across the entire galaxy myself if I have to. If you think you can handle... I'll handle whatever it takes. Nick. Damn it! Eh, they ain't getting far. I got a tracker on Golden Boy's butt. You what? Yeah, I tagged him back on the bridge in case he ditched us again. We just gotta get back to the Milano. <laughs> Rocket, don't ever change. <laughs> Tracker's online. Confirming Goldie's on the Daston Sacro Scut. Seatbelts, everyone. We're going in hot. Crap. Hold on. Hold on. Got him! Alpha Hercules system, inside the Keystone Asterism. Got it. Coordinates are in. Not getting away this time. Power down, power down! Well, can't say we didn't try. Nikki's in there somewhere. There's got to be a way. Yes, we overpower them with our own vastly superior fleet. Well, regrettably, we do not have one. Guys, we do our best work when we're out of options. Somebody's got to have something. Rocket, anything? What about the Ravagers? You could ask for a temporary truce. Yondu's rotting away in the kiln, thanks to me. You could bust them out. Jailbreak the kiln. I'd rather take my chances with the church fleet. I'll bust them out. Yeah, I'd bet on Gamora. As would I. I am Groot. So would I, but it doesn't matter. The rest of the Ravagers scattered during the war. Any survivors are laying low or serving time in one of a dozen backwater planets. Besides, what's a pirate without a ship? <laughs> Drax. You have royal blood. Perhaps it is time for the Prince of Spartax to return and rally his people. You been to Spartax lately? I have not. But Spartoi technology is well beyond... Spartax was sacked during the war because of its tech. You can't even land there anymore. <laughs> Groot, and no bad ideas. I am Groot. Yeah, that's a bad idea. We're not going to the Shatari. That is the kind of wild card we're looking for, just not that one. The snakes would shoot us in the back. I'm assuming they don't shoot us in the front. Gamora, thoughts? Maybe Earth has heroes that can help us? Those guys in the pajamas? Mighty pajamas. Trust me, Earth hasn't caught up to everybody just yet. We need somebody with a fleet. <laughs> Hold on. What if the answer's been slobbering right in front of us this entire time? This beast cannot operate a ship. That's not what I'm saying. Think about it. Cammy's pretty much useless to us, but she's also useless to the church. They want people to brainwash. I bet animals aren't even on their radar. 
They went after Cosmo. Cosmo's mind is way more advanced than ours. His intelligence makes him weak to the promise, just like Rocket. Thanks, but not an animal. What I'm saying is we know someone with an entire beast army, and I bet Raker hasn't even looked twice at her. How can you be certain she is not one of them? I am Groot. Guardians of the Gut! Nope, she's good. You do realize she still wants to flay us and feed us to her babies? Guys, this is it. Okay, our one last long shot. We've got to find a way to apologize and make things right. Okay, well, we'll get her a gift. A peace offering. Groot ain't going back in a cage. No, no, think bigger. Way bigger. The one beast that she'd want more than any other. Drax knows what I'm talking about. Oh, yes! Oh, no, 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 no. Here it comes! You know where we're going. To Maklu 4! To battle the legendary Fin Fang Foom! 